Make sure he doesn't see or smell you. He'll turn you into one of us, and he'll know I sent you. I don't want to die like Talis did. I want to live. Well, you know what I mean. You probably want to work on the smell more than anything else. No matter. All right. This is still the safest place to hide. Probably. It's just bad luck I was discovered. I must be patient. My brothers need me. Yeah, don't worry. I'm going to kill him. I'm going to kill Mr. Carrion. If Oscar has to pay the price, well, I'm sure I'm a necromancer. I've read the damn Necromancy of Thay and the Thoracite Codex. I can end a possession if I so desire. All right, well, while we're by this neck of the woods, where is the entrance to the, uh, the Thieves' Guild? Because we did get a contract of malls from Raphael in the House of Hope. So where, where exactly was the entrance to that place? Was it, I think, oh, actually, I think it was by these tents. Um, right, so they would be further in this direction, I think. Yeah, this direction. Right, there's the entrance. So let's get Charles to move over there. Let's go have a chat with Maul, and then maybe from this section of town we can get to the sewers? Probably? I think. And then maybe we could do some stuff with Jahira. I don't know. We're going to have a... I want to have a chat with Maul. I think she's, like, right around somewhere. Maul. There you are. Maul. We have a contract with your name on it? Can we have a chat about that? Ready to do some business? Um, I found the contract you signed with Raphael. Do you want it? Give me that. Can't have this floating around loose. I thought I was meant to be the thief. Oh, you've got nothing on me. Is that how you survived the Shadowlands, a deal with Raphael? That would honestly explain a lot. Why would you sign a deal with him, though? A pact is just another deal. He can call himself patron, but Big Raph doesn't own me. He's just giving me the tools to take what I want. As for what that is, well, you didn't think I planned to stop at running the Fetcher's Brats, did you? What is the Fletcher's, or the Fetcher's Brats? Is that the name of your guild thing? Um, I, I it won't end badly because Raphael is dead. Um, okay, it, 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 sure, I'll pass judgment. It doesn't really matter. I hope you, I, I hope you don't regret this. You won't because he's dead? Come find me when I'm running this whole guild. And see how easily the gold wipes away any regrets I do have. Um. Raphael's dead. I am not going to try and persuade Maul to help fight against the Elder Brain. That seems like a really stupid decision. It's like, oh, I, hello, five-year-old. Are you going to be willing to help me kill an illithid demigod? I'm like, no, thank you. Raphael's dead. You bloody idiot. You can kill half the devils in the house for all I care, but Raphael was my patron. He made promises. Yeah, I made promises too, but I broke them. This is just a hiccup, though. I'll still run this city one day, with or without Raph, and when I do, my guild won't look on you too kindly. Oh, you are a little prick. Honestly, I am going to try and convince you to fight against the Elder Brain, if that is a possibility. Until I come to collect, our business is done. Oi, Maul, I probably should... Uh, if I if I realized you were going to be a little asshole about this, I absolutely, definitely would have thrown you at the forefront of the fight against the Elder Brain. How do I get into the sewers from here? I can definitely get into the sewers from the guild hall, right? I really hope I can. All right, so now that we're in the sewers, maybe we can... What is this... Suspicious, that's a way out. Guildhall, Nine Fingers, what is this? Murder Tribunal. I suppose we just need to explore the sewers. What are we looking for? The Ancient Crypt. We're looking for, oh, that's a lot of treasure chests. It's a bunch of empty crates. 
I don't know what I was expecting. All right, let's just hope we can find a crypt, an ancient crypt. Oh God, who are you? Please don't try and fight me. Curled missing poster? A smudged charcoal rendering of a sober young boy with a scar on his cheek, missing, Misha. Reward offered for any information on, on beloved child gratefully received at Gur and Kamen in Worms Crossing. Oh, that's a bunch of the uh, vampire people, dudes. Lorna Eshtalian. Ah, a friendly face at last. Are you going to the party as well? What? A party in the sewers? I know. A bit strange, isn't it? But then you have to be open to trying new things. The venue's called The Palace. Not sure what it stands for, but it sounds very exclusive. My date's supposed to meet me here, but there's no sign of him. You haven't seen him, have you? Pale, skinny, extremely piercing eyes. Oh. Individual descriptions could refer to many things. Kazador. Taken together, she can only be referring to something vampiric in nature. It's funny. He was ever so keen for me to come. He didn't seem the type to cancel. Lorna, you want to go home and you never want to set foot in these sewers ever again. You are very extremely lucky. Your date was absolutely a vampire. A vampire? No, he wasn't. Was he? Yes, unfortunately. But then, why am I still here? He could have had me by the neck any time he liked. Um... You sure he didn't even try? It, it's because he wanted a bunch of thralls. He wanted that 7,000 count. He did seem quite interested in my collarbones. I thought that was just his thing, if you catch my drift. It's a weird fetish. You know what? I might give this party a miss. Plenty more fish in the chill Oh, bar, that as they hot, say. nasty clavicle. If you see him, don't tell him I was here. What is this, a just Game Grumps episode? I, um, I wasn't ready to be in a relationship. I'm sure he'll understand. He'll understand from the grave. You, I, I am glad I spoke with you. Um, if you go down in that direction further, you'll find the palace. What is with all this loot? What is with the mirrors? Let's have a look at myself. Can I have these? Let's have a look at myself. Magic mirror on the wall, damp missing poster. Who is missing? Chessa. Cass. Oh God, I can sympathize with that. You can never find that bird whenever you need him. Ooh, a lever. What does the lever do? I pull random levers at all times. Is there a boat? There's a barge! A barge! Oh boy, a barge! I can't wait to get on the barge. Where on earth are we ultimately going? I'm trying to track down a stupid vampire's heart. Does this go any further in that direction? It doesn't. No, it doesn't. All right, barge. Go in the other. Shadowheart. Shadowheart, are you coming with? Okay, good. Oh, thank God. You're just on the bench. Oh, I can't move. Where are we going? I have no earthly idea. Feet stop. Uh, we could keep going. Let's check this area. The High Harper. Find Minsk at the Counting House. Should I... Should I be going... Oh, God. Methods... Go for a swim earlier? What? Are the Methods speaking? Swim. Uh, must have been some other oozing, stinking lump floating downstream. The Methods can talk. Methods can talk. I'll keep I bet this ladder leads to the counting house. Yeah, let's avoid that for the hottest of moments. Let's remember that that's there. Let's um keep going on this barge. Are you guys gonna get left behind? Oh, oh God, guys. Oh, Gale, Carlac, oh, nuts. Well. Um, uh, let's go get them. Shadowheart, get on the boat. Y 
you two, get on the boat. And this time, like, seriously, get on the boat. That is a dangerous place for you. Gail, get on the boat. Gail, the boat, get on the boat. No one, okay, good, now everyone's on the boat. Mystic carry-on, mystic carry-on, ancient books, ancient, uh, things, tombs. Careful! There are doors. Oh, jeez! Oh. You know what? What does it matter? What? What have I stumbled my way into? Yeah, we don't have a lot of damage. What are, what are, what are these things? Oh, God. What, what are you, what? Nightblade. Oh, God, we need to intervene. Those guys are, like, enthralled or possessed. Attack! Slaughter them! Attack, Charles! Halt! This one is an ally of Our Lady in Red. Oh, great. Orin spoke of you. You walk in the Dread Lord's favor. Perhaps you wish to partake in his service. Perhaps Go not. Ahead. Their blood is yours to spill. Thank you, but I have business elsewhere. Um, I need my weapon sharp for other business. As you wish. Ball's blessings upon you. Uh, and yeah, beach ball blessing upon you as well. Uh, those refugees. Uh, sorry, you guys are dead. Um, yeah, I can't actually get over there. Uh, let's go in the other direction. And I really don't care for the traps. Oh no, damage. What is this area? Fine, lockpick. Break open the locks. If it's a break open the damn locks. We could be to 15, right? Oh my god. Charles. 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 Okay, 23. I think I'm, like, out of lockpicks at this point. Where exactly do we need to go? Where the hell... Is this ancient crypt? Ancient crypt. A oh, waypoint. Oh, lovely. Ancient crypt. Ancient crypt. This totally looks like the place an ancient crypt would be. Ah, oh, fine. Dig it up. Dig, dig, dig the hole. Dig the hole all day. Oh, who are you? Arabella. Arabella. Oh my god. Okay, this is actually worth my time. Give me all this crap. Oh, thieves tools, even better. Wow, Arabella, yo. I can't believe, I can't believe you're here. What is with the corpses? Arabella seems not to notice you as you approach. She's as intent on examining a peculiar stone as she is unbothered by the corpses littered on the ground. Arabella? Hey, I had a feeling you'd show up. It's sort of our thing, like it's fate or something. Glad to see you're still Check out the doing stone. good. It's magic. Incredible, right? What kind of magic? I shall study the stone. Oh, Charles, please do not fail to study the stone. You are incredibly wise. Thank you so much for that modified 31. More than double what you need. You are flooded with memories of the distant past. Creatures slain, lovers reunited, spells crackling through the air. The stone holds records of all who have passed by it. Arabella is collecting them. It's as natural as breathing for her. Hmm. Honestly, that does really remind me of like withers and him being like doesn't he have like a book of the people who are like dead or supposed to die or something is he like training up arabella to be like the next herald of the dead i guess i saw past events as if i'd been there myself and i've only scratched the surface i want to know everything bone man was right the weave will take care of me i just need to listen what did that idol do to you? 
Have you been on your own this whole time? Yep, and I like it that way. Bone Man told me to follow the weave, to let it guide me. I've learned a lot thanks to him, and I'm still learning. Interesting. Um, might I inquire about the corpses? Bandits came at me with daggers. They didn't know who they were messing with. Clearly. I told you, I've learned a lot. Again, clearly. Are we just done here? Don't worry about me. I'll be just fine. I'll see you soon enough. Bone Man said so. Okay, I guess you're just, um, f fine with being here? Woodchips Grant, Live in Large Timbo, Brigand Harold, and Ogre Boy Column. Gail, get out of the slime. All right, I guess Arabella is f fine. I was not expecting to run into Arabella in this random patch of the sewers. Ooh, a traveler's chest. How lovely. Can I have this? What is inside? Parchment. Everything is here, just as I promised to my favorite customer. These were not easy to slip past both bone cloaks and fists. The bone cloaks! We never did find their shop. We might have to. I assume you'll be prompt in leaving my payment in the usual manner. Until next time, your faithful procurer. I wonder where the bone cloaks are. Oh no, I saved, saved from the grease. Oh, nope, I failed. How do I fail? I have like the ring of immune in, 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 terrain immunity. This must be advanced grease. My faith will guide me. Will it guide you through the grease? Evidently not. Now, once everyone else comes along, they can come along. Rat. I don't suppose the rat knows the way to Mr. Carrion's ancient abode. Yo, rat. Speak with animals. You have a glowing thing on your forehead. You're a cranium rat. What? Are you a rat from the Elder Brain? That's concerning. Deeply so. I really hope these mud methods don't want to fight me, because if they do, I'll be, like, upset. Excuse me. Hi, gentlemen. What's this, cousin? Another absolutist come to see what we did to poor old Sarin. What am I looking Your at? Your god took her mind, cultist, so Bereki took her head, and I burned the flesh from her bones. You are quite large. And now you come to interrupt the funeral rites. I... Grease elemental. Yes, cousin. An excellent idea. They didn't say anything. Cousin says we will take you in return. I'm going to light you on he fire. Says you look just like kindling for Sarin's funeral pyre. My blood is literally grease. If you make me bleed, I will blow you all up. Mephits in Greece, press me and you might see some real magic. Oh yeah, trust me. Trust me. My blood literally is the most volatile substance in the world. I will destroy you. A 20. We need to beat a 15. Charles, you can do this. Come on, Charles. A 13. Is that enough? Oh my god, it's enough. Just barely. Oh, Charles on the dot. Master. Master of magic and intimidation. I cannot... I am the last of us left to do the rites. I must do the rites. Pass then, and do not come back. This is Sarin's final resting place, and a killing ground for all who come to disturb her. Well, I'm glad I don't have to kill a grease elemental. Oh my god, look at those things. Man, no wonder there's so much grease everywhere. They're, they're literal grease elementals. Charles, get up. You need to admire your people. Do you have a scroll of grease elementals? Oh my god, they're... Who are you? Are you the cousin that they were sp speaking to? Oh, you're... Are you Air A Aelis? And these are the grease elementals. Oh, I think you're... Oh, is that Saren? Oh, that's Saren. Oh... Yeah, I'm- I don't- 
necessary. Do I want to kill you guys? I could like I could light these on fire so easily. Man, I'm finally home. These are my people, slipping and sliding on the grease. My God, I love this. Finally home. I'm gonna let these guys live, just because they just seem real nice. Man, it's like I'm dead. Where is the way to this crypt? We're never gonna get out of this grease. Can you guys please not? Wizard's leaking again. Oh, that's gross. Grody. Where is the place? Door. Door? Dora, 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 the explorer. All the traps. Is this the crypt? Oh, this looks like the crypt. If I was if I was a undead skeleton mystic, that would be where I would go to. Oh, that looks that so looks like a, uh, a crypt. I don't even care about these traps. If we die, we die. Cranium rat. Oh, this is this has got to be the place. Oh, there's a dude. What is this? Don't step in the blood circle. Ancient sigils. Undercity ruins. Is that a corpse up there? Oh, lovely. But this has got to be the place. Voiceless Penitent Bereki. The Penitent looks at you silently. Expectantly. You've got the same Thanos jaw. Chin. You're running a shop here, aren't you? The Penitent doesn't respond, holding your gaze almost unblinkingly with his. Do you want to shop then? There is the slightest flicker of acknowledgement in his eyes. Finally, some, oh God, stuff. Bone spike helmet, fury in the marrow. When you rage, something for Karlak. Hostile creatures in a 10 foot radius must succeed a wisdom saving throw or take two to say psychic damage. The targets receive half damage on a save, plus two into intimidation and menacing melee attacks. What is menacing melee attacks? Possibly frightens your target. Was that on short rest? Per turn. Interesting. Very interesting. Armor of Moon Basking. Lunar Bestial Vitality. You gain 22 temporary hit points after casting Wild Shape. While those temporary hit points are active, reduce all incoming damage by one. Wow. Lunar Bestial Fortitude. You have a plus two bonus to armor class. You also have advantage on saving throws against spells. This effect persists while using Druidic Wild Shape ability. Wow, that is pretty good. I don't know if it's as good as the one that Jahira currently has equipped, but it might be. Reduces all damage by one. That's pretty nice. Unfortunately, I can't afford it at the moment, so I'm going to have to come back. But you do have Thieves Tools, so give me them. Oh god, now I can't afford the Bone Spike Helmet. Do I have anything I can sell? Uh, not on me. All my loot is elsewhere. I'll have to go get my loot. I'll have to go pick up more loot. I'll have to loot the castle. I'll have to loot everything thoroughly, and then I'll come back and buy these things. Uh, Penitent blinks, you think. You were dismissed. I'll have to muster up a few thousand dollars for stuff. All right, uh, let's save as well so I don't lose out on stuff. But if this is the Undercity, this has got to be, like, where we're going, right? That's a dude. Is this where this has got to be, like, the entrance to, like, the crypt or the Undercity? Or we'll find the crypt in the Undercity? Ancient Lair. Oh, this has got to be what we're on about. Dead human. End his immortality. I can't loot these dead humans. No matter how much I'm trying. Um, let's do... I was gonna do the Spellcrux Amulet, but my health... Eh, my health is... Uh, we need to heal anyway. Uh, Spellcrux Amulet. Uh, equip that. Use the Spellcrux. Get me my level 6 back. And can I, is, do I have the amulet 
in my inventory or is it in a bag or somewhere? There it is. Put this bad boy back on. Flawless. Um, honestly, pearl power as well. And then do... Oh, it only goes up to level three. All right, this is pointless. All right, so we need um, a potion. You know, honestly, short rest? Honestly, uh, just drink another potion. I was about to say we're fine, but eh. I'm not risking it. Cool, we should be good. Uh, so this is definitely the place. I am glad we managed to stumble our way into this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Gilded chest. Opulent chest. Opulent chest. Gilded chest. Another gilded chest. Another gilded chest. Another gilded chest. An entire loot pile. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my. Another chest. Loot. 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 Oh my god. Yes. Yes. Oh, spell rot. Oh my god. So many undead. He knew exactly what kind of trap to lay. There's no way I could have resisted this. Greater zombies. Crawling claw. They're immune to poison. Alright, well that's fine. Uh, Gale. If you're, if you're doing this, uh, just do a level 4 thing and just, um, summon some, uh, fire. And by fire, I mean ice. What is spell rot, by the way? And what is... Why did I take 29 damage? Unless you are... Oh, excuse me. Unless you are undead, each time you cast a spell, you receive 2 to 12 necrotic damage per spell level. Oh, that's bad. I'm sure it'll be fine. Um, Karlak. Can you just, uh, beat the crap out of these dudes? Here, can you do, um... Here, go Frenzy. Frenzy mode. And then just, uh, slaughter a bunch of people. Can you reckless attack? You can get to them as well. Do it, Karlak. You saved... Saved by the ice. What do I care? You're dead. You're dead. It feels oddly muted. The game. What? What? Oh god, it's bugging out. Quick, hold on, hold on, hold on. I think it's fixed. Charles does get his turn. Okay, so we're still good. Alright, alright. So that's one issue solved. Um, I definitely want... Can I don't think Charles has the ability to set up a kill zone. Um, I would really love to set up an insect plague just right there. It would be so good. But they're all going... It looks like the majority of these are going before... Actually, the majority of them aren't exactly going for Shadowheart. Only, like, two of them are. Um... If we were to... Hmm. Maybe we want to focus down on this one. This one's got 49 HP. Let's just do... Can we hold person on zombies? No. No. No, we cannot. Um, and we still have... Oh, Charles doesn't have Spell Rot. Ooh. Charles doesn't have Spell Rot. Um, okay, move Charles there. What is the spear? Breaching Pike Staff. Uh, I'm not going to worry about that. Um, can we move Charles here? And then do... We do still have the staff battery. Right. We could do the staff battery. Honestly, we've been missing out on fireball. I'm a fireball. I don't want to hit the chests, though. If we can avoid hitting the chests... Charles, I... Uh, fine. Aim for... Fine, Charles, just do a level 3 magic missile. Just do a level 3 magic missile on this dude. Torment. That way, Carla can get rid of him. Oh, there's some over there. Oh my god, more loot. Oh my god, more loot. Oh my god, there's so many chests. Alright, what do these zombies want to do? Uh, a bunch of hands are moving. Come closer, I dare you. Some more zombies are coming closer. That's fine. 
Shadowheart can set up that kill zone. And if they if they all are going for Charles. 20 damage. If they're all going for Charles, we can set, uh stop going in that direction. What are you doing? Alright, Shadowheart, I need you to set up that insect plague. Insect plague. Set it up. Can you not hit Charles? Ooh, you could set it up right there. Do it. Let me strike too. Oh, it does hit Charles. Ah, but he's fine. Did that not... Oh, the spell rod. The spell rod did damage to you, and then... All right, that's... It's not the... That wasn't the best choice, but I'm sure it's fine. Uh, right. Healing word, then. Cool. Oh, and Shadowheart took necrotic damage because of spell rod. Probably shouldn't do stupid things. And yet, here I am making stupid choices because I am... Quite literally, an idiot. But, we knew that already. Go for Karlak, I dare you. Oh no, rotting fist, whatever will I do? I'm just gonna have Gale do a ice storm. Ha ha. Cool, Karlak. Um, beat the crap out of these people. Nice job, Karlak. Okay, you're dead. Can you, um... You can bonus attack this grid or zombie. Cry about, it. Cry about it. absolutely. Go for it. Nice. Unleash me. Cool. Gale, I need you to do Ice Storm. Level 5. Level 5 Ice Storm. That doesn't even target all of our friends. What it does target is all of our enemies. We've saved me. Oh, right. Spell Don't rot. Take much more. I forget. Oh, uh, I forget. I'm sure it's fine. Did that do damage to loot? It probably didn't kill the loot. And if it did, for shame, Gale. For shame. Drink a potion. Never a dull moment. Okay, Charles. Charles. What do we have? Uh, 54, 47, 32, 27. Um... Oh, just chain lightning. Yeah, chain lightning. Chain lightning. That kills a few more and does plenty of damage to more other ones. You're gonna get knocked prone. What are you gonna do? Are you gonna come and slash us? Oh, you get knocked prone. What a dunce. What a dunderhead. Here, you can do damage on you. Nice. Carlac. I'm gonna need you to beat him. Oh, beat these ancient servants. Beat these ancient servants, Garlic. Yes. Poor fucker. What did you just call him? I mean, it's accurate, but I was just curious. So what the hell is a breaching pike staff? It's mine now, whatever it is. Force damage. Interesting. Very cool, but we also have loot. 109 gold. 107 gold. 62 gold. Not right now. More gold. More gold. I mean, honestly, we need money, so getting gold is good. I gladly take immortality practically. I shall ascend with him. Well, that's an interesting choice in words. Ancient servants, they have nothing. More gold, more delectable gold. I can't loot the hands? Why can't I loot the hands? We'll save the giant pile of gold for last. There's stuff back here. Um, opulent chest. Ooh, and a gold ingot. Wow, I can sell that for more money. Which is great. All right, what's in this giant pile of gold? Please have good loot. It's just more gold and a gold ring. All right, well, I guess I can't complain. All right, but what about these things? I shall ascend with him. 
An ancient stone, cold and damp to the touch, the letters carved on its surface appear to have been drawn by a clumsy and laborious hand. Where is he? Where is he? Promised life, eternal life, glory, riches. Where is he? Immortality, practically. An ancient stone, cold and damp to the touch. Though the letters carved on it are archaic in form, it is recognizable as the common tongue. The high priest continues to sicken in spite of the Corrigian's ministrations. I fear each breath might be his last, but with every exhalation, he whispers to me of a means by which he might live on to walk amongst us still. He does not speak of the method, but I am sure it is a reliable one. He has not performed such miracles for others. Or has he not performed such miracles for others? In the name of our necromantic purpose, has he not adorned himself with the jewels of his power over death? Were he to succeed, what wealth, what further fortune might he draw to our glorious worship? He even offers me, a mere accolade, the honor of sharing this golden immortality with him. I dare not refuse. I cannot afford to. Mystic Carrion really likes money, apparently. But this is where it's supposed... What pot? Is it one of these pots? Can I just break these vases? Break the vases. Honestly. Oh, Gale. What is... Oh, Gale has Spell Rot. Oh, and so does Shadowheart and Karlak. Oh, is that going to last for a hot minute? I'm just going to attack all the vases, I see. I don't know if that's going to be, like, you know, the solution, but it's my solution. One of these will be enough to, uh... One of... Or, I should say, one of these will have his soul in it. Or his heart. I just got to find the right pot. It's probably inconspicuous. There's a... Oh. You know, honestly, that probably may... Can we just break it down? Carlic, can you just attack the door? Do I need... Can you just attack the wall? Like, do I need... I don't even need to lockpick it. I should just... a necromantic ritual of some kind. One long abandoned. Instead of smell. instead of lock picking doors, I should just break them down. Oh God! Hi, is that your heart? Viscera jar of Mystic Carrion's brain. Oh, lovely <gasps> loot. Carlac, can you break so chests you open? Carlac, attack. Or Carlac, attack. <laughs> Medium toughness. All right, I guess we have These to have stayed find a key or something. Who are you? Dead half health. Stuff. Um, funerary jar form and function. Wow, it's engraved in everything. The upper part of this tablet describes the nen blah blah blah. Oh, excuse me. My voice is going. It describes the necromantic ritual spells employed to inhere portions of a creature's spirit within its extracted organs, and then sealing these spirit-infused organs inside of funerary urns and hiding them to preserve the life force contained therein. The bottom of the stone is crossed by a scratching of crooked letters that decipher as follows. A brilliant idea, but not an idea of genius such as the concept it inspires within me. Where better to hide such precious treasure than inside the animated body of a guardian who doesn't even know it's there? A jar that grants immortality hidden inside a zombie. It's almost poetic. Kind of, but not really. I don't want the alcohol. But give me the brain. A canoptic jar containing Mystic Carrion's thoughtless brain. Oh, that doesn't surprise me. An ancient darkness pulses gently from within. Well, this is mine now. Give me his brain jar. This jar, it feels like death itself. A sure sign of necromancy at work. Well, you'd know better than anyone else there, Charles. Give me this potion bottle. And give me this potion bottle. Severed arm. We'll keep the viscera until we loot later. Oh, man. A very, very conspicuous wardrobe. With rags. Okay, well, that's not kind of... That's not helpful. Cupboard. Nothing. Cupboard. Nothing. All right. Can I, like, eat his brain or something? Can I get, like, plus one to intelligence if I eat his brain? Where's his brain? 
Okay, she's got his... Can I destroy his brain? Where does the ladder go to? What is this? A rib cage? Shelves and tables. There's nothing else. All right. Oh, we have to open. We have to open the chest, don't we? All right, fine. Uh, Charles, put on your good boy clothes. Try to open the chest, there, Charles. It's a twenty. Oh boy. Ooh, so close there, Charles. So close. Uh, luckily for us, we've got plenty of these tools. Nice, we got that 20. Okay, what is inside? Ooh, we found his liver! A canoptic jar containing Mr. Carrion's curdled liver. An acrid smell emanates from the seam between the jar and the lid. How quaint. I wonder if I were to speak with Dead on the half-elf. I am going to speak with Dead on the half-elf. You better have something to say, half-elf. The corpse regards you lifelessly. Um, how did you get here? Carrion offered shelter, safety. I was desperate. Hmm. Uh, who is Karen? We know who Karen is. Why didn't he kill you straight away? Yeah, what? Because you you seem to be relatively fresh for, you know, a necromancer. Why didn't he kill you straight away? The ritual. Mm. Just hidden in flesh. I fail. Die too quickly. Oh, so it's not you. I was about to say, do I have to mutilate your corpse? Who is Carrion exactly? Mystic Carrion. Medium. Monster. Liar. Fair. Uh, what lies did Carrion tell? Ooh. What lies indeed? Um. What did he do to you? He probably, yeah. What lies did he tell? Promise better life given only death. Well, that's disappointing. Um, what, did, what exactly did he do to you? What kind of ritual did he force you to undergo? Black, hollow, empty, alive. Was still alive. Lovely. The spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. See, as a necromancer, I would not treat my customers with such callous disregard. Like these people drained of all blood. That's wretched. How do I get rid of spell rot, by the way? Oh, it's a curse. Doesn't Shadowheart wait, Shadowheart, hold on. Um, I learned about this. I learned, I learned. Remove curse. You don't have any level three spell slots. Ah, uh, but you'd have to use your, ah, uh, you'd have to use two level fours. Um, I mean, it has to happen, doesn't it? Oh, fine. Use it, use it. Just use your level fours. I don't care. Uh, do it on Karlak. Oh god, you have to do that on yourself. Oh, you totally have to do that on yourself. Is that gonna do- Here, if you remove the curse on yourself, worst comes to worst, you just kill yourself. Okay, well... You, you, you try. You try, Shadowheart. Spell rot immunity? What? You have spell rot. Why, why is spell rot back? I'm ready. Why did why did it come back? Um, fine. Use use the remove curse on Gale. Spell rot immunity. Why did it work? Oh, did Shadowheart die? Does that have something to do with it? Is it gonna come back for Gale? No, it comes back for Gale. 
Well, Shadowheart doesn't have it. Hmm. So I suppose it's pretty bad for Gale, but... Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting I mean, Charles times. doesn't have it. Ah, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Let's just go up here. I'm sure we'll manage. Whoops. Undercity Ruins. Oh. We've... We're all freed of it. Oh. I didn't need to waste those spell slots, did I? Where am I? Oh. Oh, do you... I bet you, if I kill you... Do you... Have the heart in the jar or whatever it is? Or did I miss something? And his immortality. We found a note in his lair and learned that he has been putting canoptic jar or canopic jars in containing his organs within his zombie servants to preserve his life. We must tell Thrumbo. Thrumbo! Thrumbo is the one with his heart. Oh, that makes sense. Okay, okay. I was I was literally about to say that I was I was gonna kill this dude because like this is the only human down here. This is the dude with the jar in his chest. It's not. Oh, I was about to murder you, friend. You have no idea how close to death you just came. All right, let's go. Let's go to Thrumbo. I think we need to go to Heapside Strand, probably. Probably. Let's go. Let's go back to Thrumbo.